Sorry. I was in the room and, and supposedly hear my words of wisdom. Yeah. <laughs> in the community and I'd like to welcome all the residents who are here, the friends who are here, staff, our special guests, fellow counselors from the county of Colchester, Truro Studiac as well I believe. Um, thank you all for being here. Uh, Deputy Mayor Cavanaugh, um, Your Worship Mayor Taylor, uh, MP Scott Armstrong, I believe I've seen him here, Ms. Scott. And of course, I'm Jimmy LaFriend, Counselor for North Colchester, and I'll be your MC for today. I'm a little grayer here since this project started. <laughs> it's been a long time coming. Um, but the important thing is that we are here today for the opening. It's been uh, six years since the project was proposed to us by the community. Uh, there's been a lot of bumps in the roads, ups and downs, uh, setbacks and, and positive times. And without the community support, this building would not be here. And that community support is the residents of North Colchester. And I'm so proud of you, and I think you all should be proud of yourselves for having this building put here. And I think you deserve a round of applause. We started out um, with this project. Uh, we knew the municipality was behind us with funding. Uh, we had hoped there'd be funding from the province and the feds. We hoped there'd be a, a major sponsor or two behind us. And some things work out and some things don't. So we received um, a, a grant of $60,000 from the province for our uh, heating system, which is state of the art. But the others didn't come through except for the community. And that's why it's so important, because this building is ours. We don't have a major sponsor, it's you people that have this building. So to get on with the, the formalities, I'm going to ask uh, Your Worship Mayor Taylor to come forth and have a few words. Here. Well, thanks very much, Jim, and uh, certainly uh, good afternoon, everyone. Uh, it's certainly a great day in Tavern Bush, poor Tavern Bush. Uh, but one of the uh, great things of being mayor of Colchester is uh, be able to share in such occasions as this and uh, share with it with you and the residents. Uh, you know, uh, I did want to uh, mention too that uh, Jimmy mentioned about the uh, uh, number of councillors here, and uh, from what I saw around, I think. Uh, of our, there's 12 of us on county council, and I think there's only three that aren't here, so, uh, Mr. Chairman, we have enough for a quorum, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> but the municipalities build a very, uh, a variety of infrastructure, and uh, of course, we've seen a lot of infrastructure here in Tatumbush that we've been involved with, but seldom does such a direct impact on the community as the library, or anything as a uh, compact, or impact as the library does. And, uh, is reflected in the great turnout here today. Uh, we seldom see this many people when we open the sewage treatment plant. That's <laughs> <laughs> the municipality is proud to be a partner in, with the community in this project. Uh, community support has helped uh, to make the library more than just a, a place to store books. I'm sure it will become uh, an important gathering place. It's <coughs> already evident in the popularity of the program <coughs> in the community space. Councillor Friends has uh, touched on some of the many people that have supported the uh, creation of this library. I just want to weigh council support to their efforts on a job well done. Uh, and it is a, a green library, and we just want to touch on that a bit. Uh, building programs are, uh, are thought of in terms, thought of in terms of 40-year projects. But the new uh, Tadden Bush Library will serve the community well into the future and for many generations to come. Uh, the design of uh, London Lynch 
and the uh, input from Jetco Contracting has emphasized the sustainable character of the building. The building has, was designed and constructed with the LEED Solar Standard in mind. To mention a few features, uh, the ground source heat pump very efficiently takes uh, heat from the ground and, uh, and heats the building through in-floor radiant heat. It is anticipated that the building will operate using 50% less energy than conventional systems. We are fortunate to have received a grant, as Jimmy had mentioned, $60,000 from the uh, former ECO Nova Scotia program to help to offset some of the environmental costs. Emphasis, emphasis was placed on insulation. The ceiling is insulation, insulated to R40, and the ICF wall construction created a tight, drag-free building envelope. The building mass of the concrete will help to keep the building cool in summer and warm in the winter. The lander, located in the center of the ceiling, is designed to draw out the warm air in summer and pull the cooler air into the building. Finally, I'd like to acknowledge the uh, kind donation of the electric vehicle charging station out in the parking lot, which was kindly donated by David Swan. I know David's here today. Yes. Thank you, David. As everyone knows, when the wind blows in Tatamush, the screen electricity that flows to the lines, thanks to the wind turbines in Coventry Hills. for many years to come. It is a beautiful space that everyone should be proud of. Uh, however, libraries are more than just a building. It will be an excite it will be exciting to hear how the library staff work to make the space alive and friendly. And I understand that the library board has extended the hours of operation already in participation of increased interest. And I'd just like to acknowledge uh, one person of our staff uh, in particular, and that is uh, Copper McPherson, who is our Director of Community Development, and uh, for the, all the time and effort he's put into this project from before day one, I guess. And uh, I thought there for a while that this was his full-time job, and he spent so much time on it. But I know he's very proud of it here today, as we are, and uh, I'm sure appreciate the interest he put in this project. And in closing, just say, like to say good luck to the community and the library staff. Hope you have many enjoyable years of operation here. So, thank you. task while well, I was here uh, that uh, got a call yesterday uh, to uh, uh, bring a certificate and uh, it's uh, from Karen Casey she's in, uh, for a special period to the host host of setting and she can't be here but she was pleased to send this certificate which uh, says presented to Tadwish Library on behalf of Karen Casey MLA and the Nova Scotia Legislative Assembly in recognition of your grand opening they did uh, April the 11th, Halifax, by Karen Casey. So, I'll so present that to the chairperson here. Okay. Thank you. Thank you.